Fender Custom Shop. What do we got? Maple Top Bass 57. Percussion Bass. Ooh, that's a nice color. Yeah, it's pretty. I like that one. Ooh, leather bound carved top telecaster. Look at the sides on this one. Look at this. Check this out. Thank you for zooming. Damn, that is not. See the sides of this guitar? This. Oh, that is smooth. I like that. What do we got here? What's this one? Cardinal Esquire? I like that. This is a little bit of a. What do you call that? A, a little bit of a chakra kind of thing going on. A little sure. bit. A little flower motif? Yeah, a little flower chakra motif. Yeah, the inlay is rad. I've seen glow in the dark ones while we've been here. And what's this guy? What's this one? Flicker Flames Stratocaster by Todd Kraus. Todd Kraus. What's your deal, Todd? I don't know, but you make a mean guitar. That is sweet. You see a lot of these and they just don't really hold up. Or there's too much. There, you see some of them where there's too many flames uh, happening. This one, there's not too much. And like the metallic paint too. They pop. Yeah, it pops out. It's kind of screaming for attention. All right, what do we got here? The Dale Wilson Tree Siren Stratocaster. Those girls, they look tortured. What's their deal? They look a little lost, forlorn. How would you describe their appearance? Uh, longing? Longing, yes. They're longing for you to play this guitar. <laughs> and they got the leaves. Check these out. Little leaves going up on the fretboard. Now, he calls it the tree siren, but uh, wouldn't they be wood nymphs? Are these nymphs? Are these wood nymphs? They look longing. That is the right, I think that is the right. I don't know. Let's see what's up. What's this guy? This is beautiful. This is a solar eclipse Stratocaster. Solar eclipse by Jason Smith. You know, I'm, I'm getting the feeling there's some paganism going on here with these guys. You got the solar eclipse, you got the wood nymphs, you got the tree sirens. I'll tell you what, on camera this looks like just, it's a red body with a black inner core, but I'll tell you what, when you look at this thing in person, in the fretboard, can you see the fretboard's red too? Yeah, it's that orange. Is zoomed in? Dark orange, a deep, a deep burnt orange. I'll tell you what, I don't know if the camera does this justice, but this is a sweet looking guitar. It's probably my favorite of the bunch here, because it's very tasteful. It's hot. This thing is nice. I really don't think the camera does this justice. This is a neat guitar. All right, what do we got here? What's this one? Zombie Stratocaster by John Cruz. Zombie Strat. John Cruz, Master Builder. What do we got? I'm going to zoom in. We got some skulls. We got some twisting. We got some writhing. We got some I hate life. I should have better, made better choices in my life. And then you got the skulls on the fretboard. Yeah, they're, working their they're way on up. pikes, actually. Oh, skulls on pikes. Oh, what's this? Oh, it says Fender Custom Shop halfway up. You see that one? Fender Custom Shop. Oh, there we go. Moving our way up. Skulls on pikes. Oh, look at that. And a big skull up on top. I like that. And finally, what's this one? This is a baritone guitar by Dennis Galazuka. Hey, if you stand right where you're at, I get your face in the reflection. Do you see that? Do you see that I see you? I can see you. Don't move. Don't move. Yep. Wave. Can you wave into that? No, not into that. Not into that. Over here, where the where the tuning pegs are, or the uh, the, the, the the controls are, the the volume and the yeah. Thank you. Sorry, tuning pegs are up there, obviously. Okay. Yeah, this one's nice. I don't know if it's got anything on that red burst one. What's that solar eclipse? That thing. This is neat, though. It's understated. Yeah, look at that. It's a very nice metallic finish. That's kind of nice. Yeah. Who's this guy? What's he up to? Hey, pal. Hi. I'm here. I'm Thunder. Awesome. Okay. Those are nice. Let's see what else we got over here. Panda. Come on, walk me through. Come on. Let's see what we got. Ooh, what are these guys? Little devils want to rock. Yeah, this is like Dia de los Muertos style. What do we got here? What's that? That's a heart. Okay. 
Oh, this is a nice style. Balloon. I dig these, yeah? This one, what's going on here? Uh, nice more skulls. The tree of life. Uh, oh. Fender Masonic Company. What do we got going on? Is this Kabbalistic? What do we got going on? Well, ironically, the Tree of Life has skulls and skeletons and crows and well, more of the Tree of Death. Like, ashes to ashes, dust to dust, we all die, you know? It's part of the human experience. What's this one down here on the bottom right? This is a uh, standard strap with the rose on This American built? It's like a rose bird. Are, are these all American built, do you think? Do, do they show a... Di- What's that? Mexico. Yeah, can I put you on camera? Oh, these are all Mexican. Yep. Because Dia de, Dia de los Muertos, hence the Mexican strats. <laughs> That's not why, but yes. <laughs> uh, okay, well, yeah, the price point gets better when you go down there, but... Oh, what are you painting over there? What's that? Just do a little live demo today. Live demo. What's your name, sir? David Lozo. David Lozo. Where's your website? DavidLozo.com. Spell it. L-O-Z-E-A-U. I'm glad you spelled it. I would have never guessed that. <laughs> say, say it one more time. L-O-Z-E-A-U. So David Lozo. You got it. Do you do the artwork on these tracks? These are my production guitars. Oh, these are your guitars. They are. They are. That's awesome. Well, where's the inspiration? Is it Dia, Dia de los Muertos Definitely. styling? Definitely. It all starts there, and it's kind of taking that same filter and, and, and imagery, classic imagery and applying it to the guitars. Excellent. How did you team up with Fender? Where did that happen? Fender came and found me. They'd seen my artwork before, and they basically contacted me and said I was interested in kind of capturing the Southern California vibe and then exploring my artwork on guitars, and I was thrilled with the opportunity. Basically ran from there. That's awesome, man. So are these like custom one-offs, or are these like production, Full production runs? production runs. There's five really? wide of each one, yep. I did do a custom one-off. That's the Blue War 2 feet one in the box right behind you. Oh. I'll take it. Ooh, yeah. is this your painting up here? The the skull is. playing the, uh, is that a stand-up bass? What is that? Guitar. guitar. That's a guitar. All right, show me. Where's the one that you did? Right behind me? Yeah, right in the box. All right, let's take a look at this one. Here, tell me about this one, Mike. Well, this is a rat attack bomber Stratocaster. Uh, custom artwork by Dave Lazou. And uh, Alder Body, Relic Finish, Vintage Hardware. Uh, 1956 neck profile with vintage frets and seven and a quarter inch radius. Uh, vintage 50s pickups. And the master builder Dave Wilson uh, put this car, guitar together for Fender. That's a rat tat tat strat. Yeah, very That's nice. how we phrase it? Rat tat tat strat. Rat tat strat. It's a little tricky by the time you get the third syllable. <laughs> you go, rat tat tat strat. Yes, yes, indeed. Uh, the very uh, vintage World War II kind of look. Yeah, it's a off. beat up kind of rustic steampunk. Salvaged, upcycled, kind of beat up. I don't know. I like it. Cool. Very, very punk guitar. It is a punk guitar, and it's my style too. I, I'm not a punk fan. Sorry, guys. Like, there's only like a hundred punk songs that I've really been a fan of. The rest is eh. Get better musicianship. Get better at what you do, and you don't need to be punk. I think I only like a hundred songs total, so that's pretty good. Yeah, and they're all like the same three chord progression. No, but I, I ran into. What would you say Henry Rollins is? Well, definitely. You know, definitely punk rock. With Black Flag back in the day, yeah. he's different now. Well, he's the Sons of Anarchy star. He does these things on um, the History Channel, I think. Secret America, stuff like that. Yeah, we caught him early in the day. He's, he's a cool cat. Henry's quite a character. Um, yeah, he came to our college and he talked. Oh, these are nice guitars. What else do we got here? We're, geez, there's so much here. Where are we at? We're, here, take a look, everybody. There are guitars as far as you can see. I don't know what you want me to tell you about it, except guitars, guitars, guitars. Yeah. We'll, uh... Everything for everyone. Yeah, how about, we'll sign off for now. Mike, sign off. We're signing off for the New American Media. Blah.